Sunday Singh from Golf Adventure. I'm going to show you how easy it is to set up a smart barrel and a 60 gallon vertical drum. To use the liner in a vertical drum, unfold the liner and insert it into the drum. The drum can be any real size, 30 gallon, 50 gallon, 60 gallon, any material, plastic, steel, stainless, wood. Next, put the gasket on, insert the smart barrel dip tube and secure it properly with a tri-clamp. Make sure the clamp is aligned correctly and tighten so it's secure. Any leakage here of air will cause the wine to go back. Now you're ready. Connect the fill hose to the inlet port, turn your fill pump on, and watch the bag fill. Now with these bags in the drum, there's a lot of excess plastic. So you need to make sure there are no air pockets in the system. So during this filling process, pull up and try to get all the wine to the bottom of the bag. You can see here, I'm kind of lifting it up and down, pushing it back and forth. And you want to make sure, as I said before, that there's no air pockets in the system. Now once the bag is full, we're going to remove any excess air from the headspace. So you can see there's a lot of excess plastic, excess headspace, no problem. Connect the aspirator, run it to remove all the headspace gas. This takes about two or three minutes depending on how full the bag is. Here, see so you can watch the bag actually shrinking as the headspace is vacuumed up. Towards the end, you will notice it looks like there's a vacuum in the bag and you'll start seeing streaks of wine coming up towards the dip tube. This tells you that there's no headspace left and the aspiration process is finished. Disconnect the aspirator. Now you want to put the dip tube in so it's easy to sample and transfer. So you push it in like I'm doing here. You try to get in the center of the bag and lift any excess plastic around it. So it basically is floating in the center of your vertical drum in the smart barrel. Now you can sample, you can transfer liquid out of it. Very simple.